Hey guys, it's me, Pedal with Mods Pro Spirits. It's your key to possible. I want to thank you guys for being this cool, awesome video. This video is part of the Braille Life series, so let's get right into it. So I haven't done a Braille Life series video for a while, and I want to get more of these out there because I have been learning a whole ton of stuff, as you guys have known from the VLR vlogs, as well as other videos of stating this. So I want to help you guys learn it as well, maybe give you some informational, you know, whatever it is. I'm thinking that these videos are really, really cool and really fun and informational, so I thought I would make them. To start out, we're in Braille Blaster right now. Now, uh, and I have a whole bunch of these different contractions. Now, these are considered uh, strong word, uh, strong word uh, signs and groups, uh, is what's on the screen right now. Uh, the first one, two, three, four, five, six we've done before, and of the with for the. Uh, these are also, as you guys can see on the left side, is the regular text. The right side is the Braille. I want to state for the beginning of this video, it's going to be in regular uncontracted Braille. Uh, so each letter or each symbol corresponds to one letter like the English alphabet. Okay, so uh, what, what I want to focus on here first is looking at the text side here where we have all these different, uh, the different text contractions. So we have CH, uh, which uh, for some reason uh, I put, sorry, I, 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 did it, I did this wrong. I messed up, guys. Don't worry. I can do this really quick. Okay, so CH is, is CH, right? And with CH by itself, if you were to have the CH sign by itself or or CH by itself be child, uh, you guys are going to understand that in a moment. I'm just explaining to the you to the uh, I can't speak today. I'm explaining these to you guys first. Uh, so GH is by itself that has a sign. SH sign and the SH sign by itself is shall, and TH by itself or the TH sign by itself is this. Um, you know, so that it's quick for contractions. Uh, WH sign with WH by itself is which? ED, ER, OU by itself is out. OW, AR, ST by itself is still. And then the ING sign. Now, here's something I've noticed because I'm going to switch this to contracted. Uh, and what, basically how you do that is you go up to here to settings and you go to translation settings. And then right now it's set to UEB uncontracted. You want to just switch it to UEB and hit OK. Now, I have a few bones to pick with the developers because some of these things are a little glitchy. Uh, for instance, ch uh, we have... Um, you know, basically the idea is this, is that some of these, the, the first ones are okay. So CH is child, which means it shows on the Braille side, the, the letter CH, and then the, the uh, CH sign by itself, which means child. Okay, then we have GH, which is the GH sign. They have it writ out as GH. Uh, <laughs> uh, they, that's not how GH is written out. GH is written as dots one, two, six. Uh, so you guys have a, as a reference, I can't make that happen on Braille Blaster because of that particular glitch. So please, guys, if you happen to know someone who's connected to Braille Blaster or you can forward this information to them, let them know this information. But we're continuing on. We got SH, which is shall. So basically, if you look at the Braille side, SH, once again, is not in its... Um, you know, its SH sign. So we, we have SH as it is, and then shall is abbreviated in the sh sign um so i guess that one is pretty okay it's just for some reason it's backwards but that's okay uh this th so the so th is right there and then th by itself the th sign is the dots uh one four five six uh that is this if you have the th sign by itself now here's another interesting one which now which is this so the wh sign is dots one, five, and six. So typically the way that the, the format in Braille Blaster should be is that I should be able to put WH, uh, you know, well, this is, this is the conflicting thing. So right now, basically you guys are seeing two WH signs right here. What you should see is WH and then the, and then the WH sign by itself. So uh, the two letters and then the one letter, but you're seeing two WH signs. So anyways, that is the WH sign. If it's by itself, it means which, okay? 
Uh, okay, if we go to ED, uh, so ED, yep, is by itself. That one is correct. That's dots one, two, four, six. Then you have ER, which is dots one, two, four, five, six. And then you have OU and OUT. Uh, so once again, the OU sign is dots one, two, five, six. And then by itself, out, but, uh, you know, the sign by itself means out. So by itself, it's one, two, five, six as, you know, the sign by itself, if you were using it in contractions. Uh, OW is correct. That's dots two, four, and six. Um, AR is not correct. Um, that's if you were to be spelling out AR. AR is dots three, four, five. Uh, so that's for you guys' reference. Again, Braille Blaster, need to fix these. Um, but it is a free program, so I'm not knocking it too bad, but I'm just saying. Uh, ST, still. Okay, so we're looking at still. So you have ST, which is written out, and then the still and, and the ST sign is dots three, four. And that's if you use it by itself, it means still. And then ing is also not correct. ing is, <laughs> I mean, it's partially correct, but it's not what we would typically use in Braille. So as you, what you guys are seeing right now, I'll explain this, is that you're seeing the in and then a g sign. So in is dots uh, three and five. So that's in and then the g sign, and then, you know, g is g, right? So that would be ing. Typically, we don't use this L because it's the contraction makes it shorter. You, the idea is to make it as short and as simple as, as as possible. So looking at this, the actual ing sign is dots three, four, and six. Uh, so uh, that is actually incorrect. Um, but the reason why I'm showing you guys these, is the reason why I, I find these very interesting and fun to do for these videos is because uh, not only is it informational for those who may not do Braille or use Braille, but I think it's also uh, very interesting to see translation programs. Um, I'm going to switch back here. I'm going to go to translation settings and I'm going to go switch back to uncontracted. Now, uncontracted, like I said, is each character represents its own, you know, um, you know, each character represents its own letter, just like the English alphabet. Uh, so if you see the differences between the sides, you can see these different things. Now, um, it's really, it's, it's not really hard to start understanding these contractions, like using like S H G H S A or C H uh, G H S H T H W H E D all them. It's really not difficult. Because you start thinking about, you know, like bed, you would put B and then the ED sign or light. It'd be L, I and then G, H sign and then T. Or you have like she, S, H, E. And then you would have um, this, you know, the T, H sign by itself. I actually <laughs> used a bad example. This is the T, H sign by itself. Uh, let's say they, so if we put the, the no, they is a bad one because of... Well, well, we'll stick with they as an example. So if you use the the sign, which would which would be the dots two three four six, you could do the t the the dot uh, dot two three four six plus the y, which would be they. Um, you know, there's all sorts of different stuff you can do. So. Uh, I think that's a good wrap up for this particular video. I'm gonna have more videos talking about different contractions and stuff. Uh, like I said. If you want to pass this information on to Braille Blaster or anybody else who may be connected to it, that would be great. There's a, just a few little mistakes here, or it could just be me that may be accessing the program in, in a weird way. You know, let me know in the comments below, whichever way it is. Uh, but otherwise, that is pretty much it for this video. Thank you so very, very much for viewing it. If you liked it, like, favorite, share the video, subscribe. If you're not subscribed, more content coming out. So once you miss it, otherwise, remember the first experience is your Gay the Impossible, and I'll see you guys in future Braille Life videos.